Okay, um, this is a how to fix video. So this is the error that they're getting. Um, this has been happening more and more the last couple of years. Error in Git Team Home 2020-0016 away 2020-0019. You know, and basically what I think is happening is the pre-files have become corrupted. So let me just show you what the error looks like. This is in my SFFDL league. This is between two coaches, no spectators. Um, we're going to just load this save file just so you can see the error. So here's the error. Error in Git Team Home 2020-0016. Error 2020-0019 asked for. So then you say OK, and it exits the game, or it crashes the game. Yeah. So then, so here's what you need to do. So whatever league it is, open up your league manager, and I will open up the league manager for this league. Now, if you, you know, I'm going to pull the pre-file from the cloud for these two teams. So this was between um, Beach City and Las Vegas. So I'm just going to select one of the teams. It doesn't really matter. And you're going to go cloud, pull pre-game file. Okay, so now the pre-game file has been loaded into your receive directory. So now you can start the game and it's going to reload that pre-file. Now it should be able to identify the teams. So I will show you another step first that I do just to make sure everything's good. So you go to this 2021 league file. You're going to launch this game because you've loaded the pre-file, not as a game server. Usually you do it down here and have your opponent join, but just launch it as a new game. Click launch. And that really like solidifies the team. Don't kick it because you won't you don't want to overwrite your autosave. Exit the game. And now when you bring up that save file, here's the autosave. When you bring that up, the error. Oh, so the error is still there. Let me try this one more time. Maybe you do need to do one play. So again, let's pull the pre-file again. Cloud, pull pre-game file. Okay, let's start the game. Okay, so we're going to launch that game. Okay, so we're going to launch it, and it, we'll, we'll kick one play. Now, you need to, if you're doing this, you need to have the, the corrupt pregame file saved somewhere else manually. So take me for touchback. Okay, so now the team should be identified. So let's go back to where I downloaded the pregame file. Copy. We'll put it in the right spot. Okay, so we want this one, copy, and we're going to put it over here. We'll put both of them over there because I had the two coaches send me the save files. Okay. So let's try it again. One of those should be able to work. And here we go. Hmm, still corrupt. All right, let's try save file two. All right, let's try that one more time. Let's try the Las Vegas pre-file.
go so we put maybe it, maybe you don't want to watch the game so let's just have the pre-file in there and try to use the auto save okay so let's go to the next step so that didn't work let's go to the lead file as it's the SS SFFTL and let's go to the pre-file loader so this is week three pre let's get rid of this okay Okay, so let's try this. All right, it's really screwed up. See if uh, I got them from because those are butcher's save files. Let's see. Let's try it. Let's try it with them. Jason save files. So let's, we're going to do the same thing, but we are going to run one play. So let's do it. Let's do like the whole thing. Run a play and then exit so it overwrites. The auto save. Okay, so it's working now. Uh, again, this is not the, so you do have to run one play and then you go out, exit and then reload the save files. So let me save this to them. So do a manual save. Okay, 
game, save game, and we'll call this JSON. Okay, so the key is you do have to run a play that will restore the pre-files knowledge of who, which teams are which. All right, so let's let's email that to them. So let's see if this works. So again, you're looking in this directory, whatever your lead number is. Sorry, it's lead, whatever, whatever, whatever. I had this wrong. Then the name of the lead, so they save file. So we're going to let them show us that it actually worked. I don't think it's with home, but I'm not sure if they were hosting. Yes, please.
Okay, so obviously something happened after I saved the file. So let's actually let's start this video over. I'm going to delete this video.